to hit the dive button at the top of your jump instead of the bottom like it was in the original. Okay. That, that I'm is... trying to remember what things I need to hit in order to set the... Uh, the uh, yeah, I, the, I don't know either, but it, it always just kind of works out, so I'm sure... That's like, usually how it works for me, so I'm just kind of hoping <laughs> that it will do the same again. It'll, it'll probably work out. It's, it's fine. There's a lot, I don't know if you've noticed this yet, but there's a lot, lot of floating tiki issues in this game as well. You'll hit like some tikis below other tikis yeah. and they'll blow the other ones float there. And I'm sure that's like especially annoying in the, um... Oh my god, damn it. Okay, so that goes into the water. Let's go, like, can I hit the button again? No, no okay. So it, it, the other way is the right way then. The correct way. So this, this part is correct. Then we follow oh. it this way. This is rough. I can't get these tiki's. I'm on the first one. I can't. I can't get these two sets of tiki's. I'm. I'm very not excited to do that later in the game. <gasps> I got one finally. All right, one left. I think. All right. Now we're there. Okay. Now. I, now I'm working this out. Fine. Wait. Pause Fire. everything. Chariot Rider has a Dark Souls update. I am pretty good at the first half, but I keep on acting dependent too early. When I see him charging Dark Magic, I activate it, but some Dark Magic doesn't uh, hit him much until later. Okay. That's your Dark Souls. Update. Yeah, I don't. I don't know. I think the. Um, okay, I got it. I think I figured it out. I'm. I'm. I'm sending it over to the last tower now. I'm pretty sure. Um, I don't know. Of the of the bosses in that DLC. Like, the... Manus is my least favorite. Yeah, Manus. Yeah. Oh, I got cool. it! Finally, the first set of Tiki's. Nine I years feel later. Like a new sponge. That was rough. All right. All right, Mr. Krabs! <laughs> Are you feeling it now, Mr. Krabs? Are you feeling it now, Mr. Krabs? Okay, I got it. I got the, the towers lined up, so that's good. Now I need to find a bus stop so I can do the Patrick thing. Boy, Ooh. Ooh. SpongeBob. Time for a little sleepy sleep, 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 sleep. I can't believe oh, I'm sleep. gonna say this unironically, but SpongeBob ass looks very weird in this game. Like I can't tell because it's so bright. Like I can't even really focus in on the ass. No, when, when you're on the bungee and you can see his ass crack. Like, his whole ass is out, but it's, like, it's on his lower back. And it's, like, it's, Where like, his is whole ass. Where's the bus stop in Goo Lagoon? I thought it was uh, next to a tower. Oh, there it is. I see it. It's just so... The, the, the game is so bright, and yeah, it's good yeah, in the sure sense that, it, like, breeze. it reflects the show more. Like, the original yeah. game was so dark that it, like... It didn't feel right almost, but I just got used to it. Like, this looks more like a cartoon in action. But, like, I can't see anything because it's so bright. True. Yeah, I agree. I, I, the bus stops just don't really stick out in this game. It's really yeah. in the background a little bit. Hey, yo. Oh, Which is weird because you would think them having a thing that says bus on it would help, but it doesn't. Nope. Yeah, they, they look like a uh, little lamp sometimes. Oh, did I get them all? Oh, nice. I got them all. Cool. All right. I thought I was gonna kill me. East? Oh, I thought you said east. Mm -hmm. Thanks for following me earlier, by the way. Uh, Shel Shel Shelvis? Good work, boy. Sheldon J. Plankton. Sheldon J. Plankton. I keep, that's one episode that I keep thinking is in season four, but isn't, is Plankton's army. Is that where he invites all his cousins over? Yeah. Oh, what season is that? I felt that's that season good. three. Oh, yeah. It's like one of the quote-unquote good seasons you know what else was good in in late in spongebob after the movie the episode where uh plankton sues crabs i don't know if i saw that one i, I didn't really know it, it, much after the movie plankton basically what happens is i fell down on the fucking beach towels uh, <laughs> uh what happens is is plankton's like i'm just gonna walk in and steal the formula instead of doing some convoluted plan and then spongebob's mopping the floor and he slips on the wet floor and there wasn't a wet floor sign and then one of the customers is like yeah uh that wasn't that wasn't right there should be a wet floor sign if i had money i would sue mr krabs and then plankton was like then instantly was like, oh, oh it was a pain, oh! And I'm gonna seal, and then he sues Krabs, and there's a court case, and it's fun. Have you seen the SpongeBob anime? 
Yeah, the 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 fan anime. Yeah, it was. It's really good. The one that just came out. Yeah. Okay, cool. Yeah. Well, cause I, they did. He did uh, an intro song for it a while ago, oh, yeah, and he's I didn't. Done a bunch of intro songs. I didn't expect there to be an actual like show to come out of it, and then there was one, and I was like, wow. Yeah, it's pretty good. I, I, I quite enjoyed it. <laughs> they take it very seriously, which I think is makes it even funnier. Oh, yeah. And what is it like? Because in the intro, they have this. And then what is it with like characters losing their arms in that in that show? <laughs> is that like is that like the creator's favorite part of anime is when characters lose their arms? Apparently. I guess so. Uh, Apparently. Right. Get in there. Yeah, buddy. Got the sock. Cool. All right. That sock. was that sock. was annoying. I got a trophy. Sock getter. What a what an original name. For... All right. Uh... I'm really curious to hear your thoughts on, on Sandy's uh, lasso in this game. It is... Weird. Yeah, it'll be a while. If, if I manage to skip all of downtown until the end of the game, it'll be a while. Uh -huh. um, I need to find a bus stop again. Shit. I should go. I should have gone back to the other bus stop, but here I am not doing that. I think there's one near this thing over here, right? This thing. Scoob, 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 scoob. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Here we go again. Hey, I made it. Well, I suppose it'll make Patrick happy. Yeah, I never I'll just do this. I'll just do this because I'm here. All right. Do what you want. We'll get... <laughs> There's so much slow down. I just destroyed a cannon and the whole game is like, I can't take this anymore! <laughs> That's funny. Uh, boing, boing. There was a wheel right there that I forgot about. Excellent, excellent, excellent. This trampoline uh, pool floaty bit is way easier in this game. Yeah. I like died twice on it in the original. The, the floaties don't make the little rubber noise anymore. I'm very sad about it because I really, really like that noise. The, the, little, like, weird the episode noise. where Plankton starts a band, that's season five. That one was okay. I wasn't the biggest fan of it. Okay. I rewatched a bunch of episodes recently for my video. I'm not really going to mention season four and five specifically that much. Uh, but I wanted to watch some just to see if there's anything I wanted to say, and there really isn't. Um, but yeah, that, that one's pretty good. Um, I like the episode in season four, speaking of Plankton, where it called New Leaf, where um, Plankton's like, I give up, and then he and Plankton's become, he and Krabs become friends, and then uh, it turns out that the whole thing is just a, a ruse to get the formula. And then Krabs gives him the formula, but it's a fake formula because Krabs like, I would never fall for that. Arg, 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 you know. What a plot twist. What a twist. What a twist. I would have never expected that to happen. All right. Hi, kitties. Hello. It's time. I love when you, when you hit the kids in this game, they get just hey, launched in this. <laughs> oh, really? They don't fall in the water anymore? Yeah. Oh, that's so funny. <laughs> Oh, I just did it. Oh, that was that's your first so one. funny. Okay. Yeah, that was my first one because I didn't have SpongeBob before, oh. so I went over and did the Patrick spatula that I needed to do, and now I'm doing the kids. Never say that sentence again. <laughs> uh, don't think too hard about it. <laughs> Sometimes pushing a single ah! button is the most satisfying. Push, push, you good? push, push. Yeah, it was just almost. I, I tried to jump on a trampoline as it spawned, and it didn't spawn. Hey, you. This is you way want? easier, though. You don't have to hit the balloons anymore. You can just hit the kids anywhere, which is nice. I like that. Oh my, now you're hitting kids, too? Oh, okay, that was a terrible idea. Okay, I died. Um, why do I know that? How many episodes of... Or how many seasons of SpongeBob even are there at this point? Uh, I think they're in 12. 12? I think. That's, that's Could be wrong. But the thing is, is um, 9 was super long uh, because... It had something to do with the development of the second movie, but like people, like fans divide it into 9A and 9B because it's basically just two seasons worth. Oh, but then season 10 is super short for some reason, and I don't know what that reason is. Um, so. The sea creatures so, yeah. were on strike. They won't take it anymore. 
It might have had something to do with the writer's strike or something. I don't remember. Um, give me a golden spatula. Thank you. All right. So now uh, it's sandcastle time. Sandcastle time. Thank you, Cole. The main. Oh, hosting me. Never mind. Ooh, fun. It's good being hosted. Is there anything up here, or is it just tiki's? I think it's just tiki's. Yeah, it is. This is how you're supposed to get to that sock, but I never get the sock that way. Okay. Um. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna switch to Patrick, and I'll do the I'll do the sandcastle as Patrick, so I can freezy fruit and get that sock. Freezy fruit is gone. Oh shit. Okay, we're good. You know what? I noticed those those fire breathing um, dragon things. Uh, that's what the uh, the 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 two bit thing is later in the game. The, the oh really? That, yeah, the three do let you fire at you. Okay, if you know what I'm talking. Rip, about. rip, 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 rip. Okay, we got we got it. We're good. <laughs> I was like, no, I don't want to miss that stock and have to reload. Uh, cool, we got it. All right, let's switch. Oh wait, I have to talk to Bubble Buddy as SpongeBob, don't I? So I talk to. Yeah, I talk to Bubble Buddy as SpongeBob. Then. Yeah, I, 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 you heard that. You're right. Okay, cool. So now that I did that, now I go back, switch to Patrick. Set up a dual stream for you. I didn't think you'd have a. Toasters didn't trust you. If you didn't know that, Chris. I'm not surprised. <laughs> Uh, uh, we fit. We tested it several weeks ago because we wanted to have it sorted before um, we did this. Because yeah. Yeah. we're trying to figure out how how I would get my video to him. Because what um, I don't know whether they do it this way now, but what because um, th this the races were originally modeled after the attacking two cans Josh Jebson versus right. That's why we did it in episodes. And when they went live, the original way they did it was with uh, the Twitch multi-stream, where you would like, it's like a, it's like a website where like you. Uh, yeah, you can, you can watch two Twitch streams at once. Yeah. Oh, was a... <gasps> I'm, an I'm an idiot. Hang on, I'm confused. How do I get to the sock? No, what? It drained down? Why did it drain down? <laughs> that, I only figured out that's how you're supposed to get the sock, like. This playthrough, or, or my let's play playthrough. I mean. Well, there's a way you can cheat it. I know. I just didn't. I didn't know whether you could cheat it like that in the remake. So that's why I was trying to do it the legit oh, way. I wasn't able to do it. It's a hell of a lot harder. The cheat? Yeah. The cheat is harder in this game. Yeah. Okay. Then I'll have to go back and. Uh... Cause you have to freeze it when you get to the freezy fruit, right? But to me, it looks like it's too high. Okay. I think so in that case, down. No, no, no. no, it it goes up and then down, and I waited too long. Is what it looks like. Up and down and all around. All right, the water's going back up again. So I hit the switch. The switch is in a different location. Yeah, I know. It's inside the castle now. It's weird that the gate exists when that happens. You know. The water didn't go up. I hit the switch. It didn't go up. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Good luck. Is there something I'm missing? The water's supposed to go up. You hit the switch, the water goes up. Maybe you have to reload it. I don't know. Okay, I'll try reloading it. No, I want to go to Gulagoon. Ah, oh, yes. Gulagoon. I'm going to have to go BRB go to clean a second here. All right. Constant issue, my throat's always dry, so I'm always drinking water. How much SpongeBob have I watched? I mean, I watched a lot when I was younger. Uh, recently, less so. Um, but uh, yeah, I watched a lot as a kid. I watched up through like season five ish and then I stopped. Okay, yeah, I have no idea. I I yeah, I, 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 I know who you are, Toast. Don't worry. Um, <laughs> and then well, who wins the races usually? So it was. It was me on this, Chris in the movie game, me in Revenge of the Flying Dutchman, Chris on Minecraft. Yes. Right? 
yeah, yeah I, I, I want, or I, I want everything but this, the original ace of this one. So now I. Oh, you want, want, you want, you want Revenge of the Flying Dutchman? Yeah. Oh, okay. I thought I did. Nah, whatever. <laughs> yeah. Uh, you have like a big time thing. I think you're in even the final level when, I, when I beat it, if I remember correctly. That's funny. Yeah, I, 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 that's the race I definitely remember the least. So. I'm not surprised. I, I barely remember that game. Well. I'm really curious when you're in, when the rooftops in downtown Bikini Bottom. I want you to look at the shadows for the buildings because, at least in the Switch version, they look terrible. <laughs> They're super. All right, like, here we go. Close. Now it's working right. The water looks weird as fuck, but it's. Weird. What? No, you can't. You can't make that jump. That's not doable. I'm trying to jump it now. That's as high as it goes. Uh, we're gonna find out. I'm gonna do it again. Hey, it worked for me. That's how I got it. I'm not used to hitting the button, the X, the X button, this many times to confirm the warp. Um, yeah, so Toast, the way we did it is um, I'm, I have my capture card plugged into um, my computer, and then I have it sharing to Discord, basically. What capture card do you have, by the way? Uh, I have the Aver Media Live Gamer Portable 2. And I had it that way because before I got this PC that I'm on right now, which isn't the best PC, but it functions, um, I couldn't record things directly to the Mac because it wasn't very uh, good. Uh, so the portable uh, records to an SD card, micro SD. Oh, I'm an idiot. I missed the <laughs> dude. Yeah, the, the Live Gamer Portable 2 records it 60 frames per second. Most underrated, overrated levels in this game. Uh, I don't I don't know. I feel like there's general consensus on what levels are good and bad. So, like, I kind of agree with that. Like, like Kelp Forest sucks. Rock Bottom isn't the best. Dutchman's Graveyard slaps. Goo Lagoon and Jellyfish Fields. And basically all the opening levels are really good. Yeah, I really like Goo Lagoon. That's not my favorite level. So I don't, I don't think there's like an overrated, underrated thing. I think it's just more of like what people think is good is what we all think is good. What do you think right. about being able to see the Flying Dutchman's graveyard right, from like right at the beginning of the game? What the so fuck? Cool. This is like this water. First off, the water looks awful. Second off, <laughs> um, so um, who's winning? Uh, Chris, really? Uh, he went to downtown first. I'm skipping downtown. Skipping around um, and we'll see if it pays off for me. Um, we are doing 100% minus the Mr. Crab spatulas, but because you need to go back to downtown with the cruise bubble, I'm just skipping all of downtown until uh, later, if possible. If I need to go to downtown after this, I will and just won't do the Sea Needle. Bring it around downtown. I don't think you'll need to. Yeah, I don't think so either. All right. This time, I think I got it. Um, bad news pass. I, uh, I feel like a new deal. sponge. I believe it. Believe it. There we go. Finally, that took a century and a half. My God. Okay. Yeah. Uh, what, what, what do you think about being able to see the Flying Dutchman's graveyard from right at the beginning of the game? Because I think that's awesome. Like that green. Yeah, I think that so level cool. of detail is really cool. I agree. Mm -hmm. But I will say it looks sloppy in the third area where it's like it, the the hub world just morphs into kelp forest really quickly, you know? Yeah. So I think it's a mixed bag where it's like it's cool that you can kind of see the areas a little bit, mm -hmm. but how they do it in terms of the hub world itself looks kind of bad. Oh, looks very so, What? <gasps> I died again! Whoa, Which characters in the show mind. are not already in the game should be in this game? I think everyone's represented pretty much. Except like old man Jenkins and like Fred the Fred. There's no like, bubble bass. There is no Where bubble bass. Where is bubble bass? That's a good point. There is no bubble bass. I'll give you that. In the original, you spawned at the top of the castle when you made it through. So I, I'm kind of sad that uh, I have to go through this again. What do you think about that extremely loud? What was that that happened when you died? Yeah, I'm not. I'm not a huge fan. <laughs> you don't love it piercing your ears. No, I can't say I do. Are you heading to Gulagoon now? Yeah. What are the collectibles? Yes. Uh, golden spatulas remain, and then uh, every 10 socks you collect gives you a golden spatula as well. 
and there's a shiny object spatula, but we've, we've mentioned it several times. We're not going for it, but if we get them, then they'll give us an advantage at the end of the game. Yeah, we're definitely not getting all of them, though. That would, because in the remake, the requirements are upped, um, we uh, would have to grind for two hours. Unless at any point you decide you change your mind and you want to grind for them, I'm, I'm down to do that as well. But I'm also <laughs> fine to not do that. So the underwear don't, and socks don't matter. The socks matter, the underwear's health. Yeah. It's kind of weird that it's all like clothing. <laughs> Uh-oh! Well, I just killed myself. That's fun. Yay. Okay, it helps I'm gonna, me. I'm gonna go pee while, while, while the play opening cutscene plays. One second. Fun. They should add Ash Lake as a DLC area for Battle for Bikini Bottom Rehydrated. That is a brilliant idea. Let's do it. All right. Sock for Matt. And that should be it. So now we head to the next area. Finally. It took me a century, but we did it. Thankfully, the rest of this doesn't take that uh, long. Goon, so. a goon. A sun and honestly, like Chris was kind of lost in downtown at the seat. start. So I'm hoping that when I do get to downtown, yeah, I'll be all right. Yeah, we're doing the whole game today is the plan. Um, but we'll see. Uh, switch back to SpongeBob. Where's Gary? There's Gary. Hi, Gary. Uh, you guys should really give Simpsons Hit and Run a try. I've heard good things about it. I haven't played it personally. Nope. Wait. Howdy, yo! Oh, yeah. The respawn animation is, is a classic. That's, like, one of the best things in this game. And the original. The, the That they have, like, the hand come up and get you. Because it's, like, such a... It's such a good reference. Uh, that's just underwear. You guys should really give Simpsons Hit Run a try. Yeah, I, I, I haven't mentioned that. I haven't, I haven't played it myself. Have you? I've seen some. I've seen a little bit of gameplay of it. Yeah, time. it's like kind of like cartoony GTA. It seems seems pretty decent. A hundred and night of a hundred frights. I never heard of that one. What is that? What is that from? Night of a Hundred Frights. I don't recognize I... that. I'm trying to remember. I don't know. SpongeBob. Larry the Snail. Larry the Snail. And... Alright. Alright, Mr. Krabs! I'm <laughs> I think it's weird they have a throw fruit up here because you can't get here with Patrick. You have to. Yeah. They have that. Oh, I, the I guess they have. I guess you could if you unlock the area, of SpongeBob. Like you do the bubble bash to get to that area, and then, um, then go back as Patrick. But like, why would you do that? I don't know, man. I don't know. Man, that, that's like the uh, the Mermaid layer one. Um... At the main hub of the Marvel layer, that there's just there's a there's a throw fruit there that Patrick can never access, legitimately. It's very strange, very strange. All right, so now we head back, right? Yeah, because we have to go to the other side now. Oh, I'm so dumb. I am so dumb. I am so freaking dumb. I am a dumb. Dang it, I suck. I'm getting all these lifeguard towers wrong. Hi, Matt. Yeah, that, took, that, that took me a little bit. Hi, Chris. How you doing? I'm okay. Uh, that was Wait, how do I activate that side? Am I an idiot? I might be an idiot. Could I get to the other? Hmm. Oh, what the hell? Wait. Oh my God. I was, I was hitting the wrong. What's wrong with me? I say the wrong lifeguard tower. Yeah, I think you activate that from the other side. Then how do you get there? I, I'm, I'm doing something stupid. Wait, what's, what's, oh, uh, just... I'm just being stupid in, in uh, Goo Lagoon Caves. Don't worry about it. Oh, what else is new? <laughs> I'm sorry. You got, you got stupid. Oh, I died. I think Matt is winning because even though 
Chris is fast farther in the game, Matt is more engaged with the audience. So that makes us the real winners. All right, I'll take it. I'll take the moral victory. Oh, I'm an idiot. I just didn't see the, the platform that's right here. Perp, derp. Ah! All right, uh, Toast, uh, I'm sorry, did that message be teased the mod and ban me from the chat? I think it did.